Hello, hello, grade 12s. Welcome back to the channel, Science Therapy, hosted by the one and only science therapist, Uabudua Sos Ukobela Wemet. And without any further ado, let's look at this question that we have here. Rrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
we will end up with PR sine 2y. Now let's call this our equation number two. Substitute equation A1 into equation number two. So we want to use these two equations now. Then in the place of PQ, we're going to substitute this expression. So this is a H over tan Y multiplied by cos Y is equals to PR sine 2Y, right? But then you will remember that tan Y here, if it's in the denominator, this is the same as having one over tan Y, which is the inverse of tan tan y would give us sine y over cos y but then one over tan y would be the inverse so this would be cos y over sine y right and then let's express that that means h multiplied by cos y so if we just say over one here you understand that we'll say h times cos y this will give us h cos y but then uh, if we now have to express the tan y in terms of this, this is a uh, cos y over sine y, right? And then equal to PR sine 2y. Now at this point, we can see the cos y and the cos y will multiply and therefore we'll end up with cos squared y. And then over here, we have sine y equal to PR sine 2y. Right. Now, how do we get rid of this sine 2y? We can multiply by the reciprocal 1 over sine 2y on both sides. So remember what I do on the left-hand side, I must also do on the right-hand side. Now, at this point, the sine 2y and sine 2y here will cancel out. But here, this would be 1 multiplied by h cos squared y which will be h cos squared y. But then sine 2y times sine y, this gives us uh, now this side we are left with PR so this should be equals to PR is equals to H cos squared Y over sine Y times sine 2Y remember this two cannot multiply because uh, the angles here are not the same so we leave it like that it's H cos squared Y over sine Y times sine 2y and that's how you uh, prove that one so for a total of six marks that's how you were required uh, to prove that equation right there so okay please press that thumbs up button if you've enjoyed the lesson and then you found it helpful and if you've been watching the videos and haven't subscribed yet please 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 smash that subscribe button but most importantly Please share the link with your friends and classmates so that they may also find assistance. Remember, do not be selfish. We are winning as a team.